Hello, welcome back to episode 2, where we left off with literally fighting for our dear fucking life. And he's literally murdering our asses. <clears throat> for the love of God. Oh shit, he's still coming. Why the fuck is my train moving so fast? Because it has no more life, you need to repair it. Oh! <gasps> I actually... Oh fuck! Oh shit! Hey, shoot, 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 face, 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 Wow, look where we reached it. Look where the fuck we gone. So, thank fucking God, I got all that scrap. Yeah. Oh my God. Okay, so this game is a little... Um, extreme, let's say that list. Yeah. The mob is hiding and you put the name on me. So the monster... Wait, wait, go, 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 stop. Actually go forward, go forward, go forward. And I'm gonna stop literally right there. Yeah, so he attacked us because we're literally getting close to this. We also have the lock picks. We should also try to go with... Where? Where, 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 where? Mining has been proceeding smoothly and we're seeing signs of solid vein already. The tools are still holding up well and we finished construction of shelter. We have spent we haven't spent long here, but we're getting settled in and adopting a good rhythm and schedule to our work. Okay. Doesn't really fucking matter, let's just quickly go into the mine. I'm guessing this one is the mine. Yeah. Wait a second, what exactly is the mine? So it's actually much down that way. But how are we gonna fight them? I have no fucking idea. I think the first one, it's unguarded because she gave us the key though. I really hope I don't see Charles around here. While mining the part of the tunnel, we broke through a wall into a large cavern. There's something strange here, we don't know what it is. We're requesting that Mr. Warren visit the southern mine site at his earliest convenience to give us further instructions. Oh, what? Oh. Learn to spy on enemies and avoid being spotted. Lin and I'm guessing crouch? We don't have crouch actually. Is that a dude? I mean, I don't want to get, uh, but it didn't let it long enough for me, so there's not control, there's not C, so you cannot actually crouch. It's probably walking normally and just waiting for the asses, right? Yeah. Which way should the fuck should I go? Dead end. Okay, just keep going that way and we'll find a direction somewhere. So what happens exactly if I get found found? Uh, definitely something you like to try it. I think I managed to actually find the location we need to go without actually trying too hard. Wait? Where is the dude? Ha! Suck it, bitch! 
so I managed to avoid getting raped. Fucking, okay, I need to remember where the fuck they came from. So it was this to going forward. Yeah. That way, yeah. yeah. Holy shit! I think I managed to actually escape without going the correct way the game wanted me to go. Yes, but why am I carrying an egg? Do I really want a confrontation with Charles right now? I don't know if it's going to happen. I don't know if it's going to happen. I don't know if it's going to happen. Yeah, in the thingy, but is it good though to have the eggs on you? Like, actually thinking about it? Would you rather go to the boss layer? Do you need to go back to the... No. So I'm just gonna try and actually go to this bitch. Should I just leave the train like here and then just go like... Because oh. I don't think I can turn around like this. In theory. No, I'm just saying we should also get the scraps on that one. Because that motherfucker literally ended the train. He jumped on the train. So should I stop like here and then just run or should I try and see if I can go like this? Try and see, right? Yeah, I can see the but it's annoying that you need to make sure that you're not getting molested, let's say. Uh, okay, let's just go back now and see if we can actually go on to that side no yeah so sh i should just stop there like like here the only level is this one it's up or left and i need to go to the crazy lady here it, it, i mean in my opinion it's stupid to go like yeah, yeah, yeah. better just run down there and there's also one deep here as well, look. In that direction. Here. So... The next mission is that way, so we can literally just go like this. And we're also gonna meet a crazy dude. Maybe he's scared, I don't know. I'm curious to see what happens if you actually find him in the wild, like, uh, you... Jesus! I almost cut my pants! Because you can see him move and shit, right? Look how close it actually gets, like, jokes aside, look, you already see it. So I think they did, they did an actually good job with the map. It seems quite big, but at the same time it doesn't take you, like, fucking 20 minutes to reach one point. It's still a speed up on process, so you still feel like you're um, in the game, like it's not gonna... Oh yeah, I'm riding for like 20 minutes and still no sign of anything and I don't have anything to do. It's actually a good idea. Let's see if I still have the thingies. Yeah. So I have the pair of lockpicks and now we go and actually take the... And how did I uh, regenerate my health? I have no idea. Does it regenerate? Wait a second, do the scraps respawn after a little bit of time? Wait a second, I'm still going forward, right? Oh yeah, look! No, the scrap, I mean. Because I already took the scraps from here, if you remember. So they do regenerate. Actually, it does make sense. You kind of need to go all over the place a couple of times. Yeah. Uh, makes sense. I don't know if I hate this or I like this. What do you think? Should you hate this or like this system of lock picking? Ah, I know, if you're an uncoordinated person, you're fucked in this type of game. With the clicking on the correct one, because at least in Skyrim there's a little bit of... Yeah, but even in Skyrim. 
Yeah, you do fuck a lot of them, but that's actually a little bit of more uh, manageable than just, you know, pinpointing on that one. Even though I prefer this, this is much more simple. I, I don't think they could have worked with a, with a proper lock fix system, because it's an infinite lock fix, you saw. Yeah. So, bro, whatever the fuck you do, don't eat these pickles, they're the last ones. Thank you. Yeah, they don't respond in the... Where my train? Right, my train's all the way back there. Let's see how much scraps I actually have at the moment. Whoa! I went with 45 scraps, bro. I think I should also increase... I, I think the most important part, to be honest with you, I think might be actually the speed and the, the, the damage. Because in, I'm guessing he needs a specific, like, a specific amount of damage for him to fuck up. Yeah. So, and also the speed, because if he cannot manage to reach me, I have enough time to actually do damage to him. Even though kind of the armor is also important, because last time he literally jumped on the fucking roof. Yeah, because you weren't shooting him. No, before I shooting him. I forgot I was trying to see where, it, where the fuck he was. And then he just jumped on top of it. Let's go with an armor as well. And let's go with the damage. And keep the rest for repairs just in case. Or not. Oh. Yeah, but I need to still go to the right. Trying to go that way. I think I should go a little backward and then for I was still on that course. Yep. Right. So, whoa, whoa, whoa. I think this is where the second one is, right? Yeah. Careful with the damage. Fucking hell. I always forget about the damage. Why do they need to feel like they need to place me in damage as well? I always hated that shit. Doesn't he do enough damage? I guess it makes sense, you don't want to just jump around the cliffs. Okay, so here he is. Let's see if we can... Okay, let's see the notes. I've been praying someone from the first evacuation group will just send back another boat, but I guess they all think that George Supplies boat is still evacuating people. They're all safe and cozy on the mainland, but feel no obligation to make sure everybody else escapes. I know that Charles thinking the boat isn't something anyone would expect, but still, to think I would have left this place by now, it makes me sick. So I'm guessing poor dude is still waiting for him to fuck up, right? Because I... Yeah. My goodness, the others actually convinced someone to come help us. Yes. I'm so glad you came, but I simply cannot stay any longer. This island is too much for my nerves to handle. Yeah, makes sense, makes sense. I've brought all my belongings here, so I can leave immediately when a boat arrives. Again, makes sense, sir. Although now that I think about it, I did, I did forget, forget my, my journal at home. It's a dangerous journey for sure, but you oh. have all the scrap metal I have. Oh. Just please, bring it. Let me guess where it is. Wow. Yeah. It's literally Kukamunga. Uh, I think just, and then just no. run like this, yeah, and then yeah. just, uh, so forward and right. Okay, so the first episode is 30 minutes. How long should the second episode be? You know how long will that should take to upload? <laughs> yeah. You, you, you imagine how long will 30 minutes, man? Yeah, I think 30 minutes as well. Or just finish the secondary mission, because we also have some things to do mm. and then just continue mm. later on today and just do this like a series so this series will continue for a couple of mm. it is blood it it is literally blood oh, 
Yeah, so it is actually blood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see. Uh, unloading all the supplies have been an incredibly eye-opening experience here at the port. We've been working all day every day. We're tasked with unloading the boat and running supplies up the hill to the tracks. Where Theodore and Eddie deliver them to different sites will be mining. The sheer cost of all this infrastructure is mind-blowing. With all the success of Warren's family has had in the business, I'm sure he's choosing to take such a risk here. And I'm guessing he didn't manage to actually unload the rest of the supplies. Yeah. Track of blood or? Yeah, yeah. Oh, uh. Well, thank you for the scraps, dead man. Stupid. So I need to pay attention closer in the background because that fucker might just be lurking around. Because I didn't saw it that time, you actually saw it. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. He literally went like that. Oh, look, I'm faster than a train. Okay, so I need to go right. I mean, this time we can literally just go back if we really want to, and then go like that. Mm -hmm. It's kind of weird you cannot actually change the backwards situation, but I guess it makes sense. And you cannot see him on the map, right? Nope. Like it shows a little train shit or something trying to eat your ass. I swear to God, remind me just to look next time. I'm curious to actually see if it shows him. Oh. There was something there. Yeah. It's fucking weird because you actually need to be on the lookout all the time. Or don't be on the lookout and get, you know, jumped. I don't like that stupid minigun, it's overheating very fast. Huh. Interesting. Is this it? Yeah, I want to meet the cookie person. Don't you want to have his perspective as well? He's li the, there's literally the, the main mission here, and then there's literally the cuckoo guy on the right. Mm -hmm. And I don't like the fact that I cannot literally jump from that over there. So on the gun, jump out of the train. Okay, let's just go into the cuckoo person's house and see if we die. Sir, Jesus fucking Christ, is that the fucking rocket launcher? Paul asked me to design a new weapon to help you hunt Charles. And using my extensive demolitions experience, I made this rocket launcher. Thank you, sir. I've mm -hmm. been wanting to see Warren's empire crumble for a long time. Now that you're here, I need a few minutes. Features. While I'm working on that, why don't you bring that box of rocket ammunition back here from inside the bunker down the rail? Was this the main mission? No. No, it was supposed to be the red person. So it's not a cuckoo person, babes. Oh, take the other red one then. Uh. Oh, it was down. Look there. No, it's weapon a weapon mi mission, oh. my. Okay, so let's just quickly go for this one and just ignore this one for the moment. Or just. I don't want to take it, I don't know how it works with two missions at the same time. Actually, it worked okay, right? We had the, cra the crazy lady. Yeah, fuck it, let's just get it as well, it's literally on the right. Plus, we need to go forward, so, yeah. It's gonna save us a little bit of trouble just always going back and forth, back and forth, right? I need to write this theory down fast before Warren finds out I'm onto his dirty plot. My theory is that Mr. Warren Warlord III is trying to hatch and raise more of these eight-legged creatures. A whole army for who knows what purpose. They found a whole nest of those eggs while clearing out debris from the cave-in. We also know that they're hard as diamonds, completely indestructible. The miner spends months using the template permits to suck the energy of old, out of old eggs. But before they could destroy the last three, old man Warren stopped them. Warren must have realized how powerful these things are, and rather than protecting us from from them, wants us to take use them to take over the world. He might actually make some very good sense, to be honest. I'm sure you told, you told you all about me, so I introduced myself, name's Greg. Boss is keeping three monster eggs locked away. Your sympathy turns to most of the creature like Charlie, yeah. 
We need you to kill all three and use them to bait. One, one, oh, and now the mine is the key to the entrance. Yeah, so this was the key to the next egg. So I'm guessing this is not actually a long game, by the looks of it. So we might actually finish this in like three episodes max. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so the second one is this one right here. Which is, yeah, and then probably one of these is probably the third one. Yeah. Let's see, so I'm guessing stop the now. So we need that rocket launcher. I just got dynamite. Yeah. Wait a second, is it still forward or...? Yeah, so it goes like this. I'm guessing for like two hours. Gonna probably upload to YouTube. I did say! Oh, come on, I was not expecting him to go like fucking 20 miles an hour. Okay, let's go. Bullshit. Oh! No! Oh shit, no! You almost died. Yes, by being a moron. Oh. Let's first just read this. Version 1 failed, version 2 failed, version 3 30 seconds, version 4 successfully. Uh, I don't like the looks of this. Ah, look, this one is one that you actually need to return. So it actually tells you, hey, you need to return to John's me to complete the me. I mean, same, it was same with the people maybe. Oh. Why it's. All of a sudden, everything went even more, you know, uh, misty. Uh. You see how misty it is now, right? Yeah. What? I. All oh, right, it said turn, return to him, right? It did say return to him, right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Hello, bro. The launcher is in complete working order, so I'll let you take it from here. Oh, and take good care of it. After you're done, I have a few people to visit with it <laughs> if you catch my drift. You know what? I catch your drift. You do whatever you want. I'm not gonna fuck around with the dude that invested, invented the rocket launcher here. And stuck debating if Warren made us brings our family to this hellhole so that we never have to leave. Or to keep information about his business practices away from the mainland. Either way, I want that man in a noose. Paul asked me to design a new weapon for the monster hunter that Eugene is sending. And I know, and knowing what I do about explosions, you can bet I made the most powerful rocket launcher I could. Uh-huh. So I'm guessing you cannot actually talk to the crazy people. You're gonna probably encounter them while they're trying to stop you, I'm guessing, right? Yeah. Oh. I shouldn't use this yet. What? Mm -hmm. Yeah, the boner is, is the, the boner. boner. Ah, it's gonna be the boner Ooh. from now on. You know what? Fuck this. Stop. Stop the train. Stop the planet, I wanna go down. Let's go for this dude as well. I'm curious, let's be honest, when the fuck will I ever reach this one if I leave him now? I'm probably gonna finish the game before doing him. I'm guessing they... Oh, right, right. I'm guessing they want us to actually go like a full circle. Because look at this. So we got the first mine, right? Somewhere... Somewhere, right? Yeah, down there. Yeah, and there's the second mine right here, right? So I'm guessing the third mine is some over around here and then the main one. So they probably want us to go all around the map. At least once. Or maybe you could avoid it. I, I actually have no idea to be honest with you. Weapon dealer? 
Yeah, yeah, one hundred percent. So we have like five of them. Five. Yeah, five of them. I think five with the minigun that we have the first time. Yeah. So I'm guessing you could probably upgrade them, or I'm guessing these ones are not to be upgraded. Huh? I don't know. I think I don't think the upgrades are specific for each weapon. So I think if you upgrade the damage, you can upgrade it for all of them. Yeah. Who knows? We should see. Please deliver a copy to Paul. I want. I went. I went outside to do a routine check on the la of the lighthouse. As I walked around the corner of the building, I saw the beast charge. He spotted me and charged straight up the hill in my direction. That spider train is hideous monster. I can't understand why Warren wants us to stay on Areum instead of trying to escape the beast. I suppose Warren has simply gone crazy thinking he can handle this situation on his own. In any case, Charles r ran right over me, trampling my leg. I wouldn't be able to attend the upcoming meeting and have asked Greg to bring back a copy of your notes if possible. Ooh. Damn, she got molested. We haven't met. But I've heard lots about you coming to help us. I think this game will actually make a lot much better if they could actually, even though it's an indie studio, I mean, if they could just move the mouth a little, some expressions, it will even drag me more into it, sincerely. The breakers on the side of the lighthouse need replacing. I was recently attacked by Charles, so I'm unable to do it myself. The breakers are in the nearby supply shed. If you go get them and repair the lighthouse, I can try SIG once you finish, I have You know what? Some voice actors are, uh, they did try their best. Some of them, I think they were just fucking around. Like that one that literally spoke like... Mm -hmm. The crazy lady did it like 100% for an Oscar. Fucking butt. So I need to go down there, I'm guessing, right? Yeah, was on point on that one. Yeah, 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 I'm not gonna try to kill myself again. Jesus. Wait, can I... Wait, I don't know. There are like four of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then on the right. Can I just... Oh. I'm just trying to get as much fucking scrap as fucking humanly possible. They literally, that dude with one little battle almost obliterated me, the train, the weapon, and the entire game like that. Like, it, I didn't even stood a chance, bro. Let me just replace this stupid shit. Yeah. Oh my god, no. So it's this, this, no, it's this, 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 this. Oh! And now Charles can just come here and pray for Charles, wait for me to get my scrap and then you can come and rape her. Fixing the lighthouse will definitely increase yes. here are those scraps. I've Thank you. How much scrap do you think we got? In total? Huh? Sixty-six. Back. But they're not. He's not actually attacking me on the ground, is he? Like me just running like a moron. So that means can I literally just finish the game by running around the place without a train? I don't know, bro. He didn't attack me yet. So we did the missions here. Okay, let me just see if the... No. Increase all weapon damage. Yeah, that's what I said. Should I... What should I increase then? Should I go with both of them to six? Yeah. And then just keep the rest at the moment? Mm -hmm. Okay, so where is the last one that we're doing before we start? No. What? 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 No, no, go back to the map. Okay. And look at the lighthouse. Ah, oh, that's fucking beautiful. <laughs> oh, okay. the journal return. Oh. oh, wait a second, look. So, in theory, if we go like this, right, mm -hmm. and then switch this, 
should we should be able to go like this to show so should we go return the journal and then end it on the last mission or should we just uh, end it by returning the oh this is the journal of the dude from the port yes so that means i should go like oh my gosh that yeah, all the way back No, you can't fucking place markers. You did. Oh my god, you can place markers. Help, I don't know how to remove the marker now. Place waypoint. Oh. Yeah, I tried that. Just place it where you want to reach and then... Nah, I'm just gonna leave it like that for the moment. Oh, I don't like that. I, mean, I need to look on the controls for the next episode. No, I was thinking to put it... And then just go into now. it? Yeah. Oh. Maybe it just goes away. Some games actually do that. Yeah, exactly. I hate that. Ooh, Theme. Theme of G's. Do you think you can still find random rockets, or do you have like a limited amount of rockets, or it just looks like... It's unlimited. Oh, yeah look, I reached it. No. No. We're just gonna look into the controls. Literally, we need to look into the controls, I have no idea. It's a, it's a nice feature, but it's annoying if you're actually... See? Mm -hmm. It's kind of fucks with your Feng Shui, let's say. I thought this was a giant chest, to be honest. Mm -hmm. That dude should be... Oh, right there. I'm glad when I placed it on the correct path. <laughs> Yeah, I think the game wanted me to go all the way around the map to actually reach these places. Mm. And I'm not doing that because I'm a lazy fucker. Hello, can I? Say, you're the monster hunter. Yes. I must know, do you have any experience with ghosts? No. Someone or something has been pinning exactly 16 drawings to lampposts in the boulder field every night. I always collect and burn them, but as I was looking for them last night, I began hearing strange... I only found half of them yesterday because of the commotion. Could you go find a left? That sounds like fucking Slenderman situation, to be perfectly honest with you. You realize this sounds exactly like Slenderman, right? <laughs> huh? Yeah, I think I should just go back and then all the way to this dude and just go like this. No? Yeah. Yeah, I think that's literally the best option, to be honest. And we're gonna finish this episode by literally going, uh, by reaching the train. I heard the train. Yep, go back, go to the train, go to the train, go to the train. Uh, he's where? Oh, did you see him? I'm fucking see shit. Yeah, I don't think he's attacking us when I'm not in the train. Then why would the game uh, push you to stay in the train? Yeah. Because this is the main point where the they coded the dude to attack. I mean, yeah, but. The game did say that you should stay as much as possible in the train because that way you safe. How am I safe in the train? Literally the train, if you actually think about it, the train is the worst idea to actually stay in in case that that fucker is actually... that fucker is actually trying to get you. Right? I mean, that's the idea of the game. 
Should I just change for this one? Sure, why? Let me just... I need to see how... Oh, it takes a while though. See? I think this is good for like long range before he gets close to us. And then once he gets close to us just... And then... Right? Did I reach it? Shit. Oh, your idea. No! Yeah, I fucking see him. Can shoot him, can I? Fucking quick. Did I shoot him? Managed to shoot Charles? I did manage to shoot him, right? Yeah, fight the train at the moment. Hold your idea. Oh shit! <sighs> I hope that progress doesn't actually fucking... Um... No, no, you just respawn at the train. Fuck, that was intense. Oh my god, okay, I think that's a perfect ending for this episode. Oh. Alright? And again crashed a little this way. Yeah, it crashed. 36 and then just jumped to 37. The game autosaves as you play, pick up or you left off every time, so it probably autosaves every couple of minutes. Mm -hmm. So it works, you don't actually damage the train, you actually damage the dude. So you can shoot you through the train. Any damage, so what exactly did they? Oh. Oh. Okay, Look. so fix the train, please. You think the train should do? You have it right there. Once its health start uh, goes down completely, then you start getting damage. Oh. So so it's pretty much the health train and then my health and yeah that's what i kept that's why i kept saying yeah 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 yeah, 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 makes sense makes sense okay. so what happened if i was literally going to uh, change the direction of the train and went through him next time if it comes like that i would just change it straight for him so he can go back right thank you so much yeah 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 we work on but, um, that was crap i promise thank you sir how much stuff did you get how many did I have? Whoa! He did give me quite a lot. I think I was down to 30 or something like that because of all the repairs, right? Yeah. Okay, so we're just gonna literally stop the episode here uh, while I reach the train. And actually, I'm gonna stop it right here. Huh? Mm -hmm. So the next episode will go on to the left and. God have mercy on my soul. It's quite actually awesome. It's not that horror like I thought, but. You know what? I like it. It's action-packed. It's not. Um, it's a little horror, but it's not like that kind of horror that tries to literally make you cap your pants like the mortuary assistants. It's that kind of horror, but at the same time, if you think about it, it's quite a little bit of a fun horror, right? Mm. Come on, how horror can a fucking train of legs be? Let's fucking be honest. I don't think you've seen the creepy pass. I would uh, talk about the train. Yeah, this was the whole point of the game. That was the whole point of the game. So yeah, stop. Okay, so thank you very much for... Um... Wait, just held back. No, 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 back, back, back. Okay, so thank you very much for the viewing. And sorry, it's been the episode's been kind of long, especially this one. Next couple of episodes, we will try to make it going the correct way, right? Yeah. Because I said I wanted to go left. Yeah. Okay. 
yeah so the next couple of episodes i'm gonna try to keep it a little more down niche i guess because it's quite a lot to actually look at uh, oh oh damn did you see that no. i changed it without getting out of the train thank you yeah so we're just gonna stop around here and then that's it stop okay so yeah thanks for watching thomas the train engine trying to rape us and see you guys on the next episode I'm gonna finish this series even if it gets no views or I, I don't actually give a fuck, this game is quite awesome and I want it up on the channel. Thanks for watching and don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the Thomas Tank.